from the common and usual way of celebration. The excitement. The applause. Are temporary concealed by the pandemic. And the chance to personally accept the fruit of your labor. And celebrating with your friends is not yet possible. But because we are unstoppable, we will make the impossible possible. We will make things happen because we perform, we transform. Streaming tomorrow on William Miranda Integrated School official Facebook page, YouTube channel, and at Barangay de Bulwan San Mariano Isabella. See you there mga kabilya! Thank you.
Anda. naman ngayon anak. Ikaw na ito na. Di mag-away lang tadi diya ma. Sino naman kasama nyo sa bahay ngayon? Ay di mag-postcard yun ako na. Si Inang at si Tatang? Oto na. Nasaan sila ngayon? O di di tadi diya mag-away. Yun lang ba ang kanilang ikinabubuhan? Mag-detik pala hindi bawa ni mag-away na. O Loida, malapit na ang pasukan. Ipagpapatuloy mo ba din ba? Bakit naman ang gusto ko nga magkatapos ako ito yung skwela ng mga ipwa at ipotihirap ni Itadikal may limang papada ni kami gusto niya matapos ang pag-skwela niya para makatulungan may din o makatorpos kami na. Magandang balita yan para sa amin anak. Kung kaya't may dala akong mga module para iyong gagamitin sa darating na pasukan. Ito anak. Maraming salamat ma'am. Walang ano man na. Ano ti kaya mo nga ibtid nga support ta kini Loida? Ay pila kun na ho dai matupad na gusto na ya arapa na makaadal siya Tang ta siya labi e isaya na kaadal ni kami ya pag asa mi asa pa la ko makala maka kwasia maka makaturpo siya to gusto na kuna Purposan na pag-eskwela na kung ano. Suporta kami dala siya at nung niya may tulong niya ni kung natang pagkawusto nila matupad na warapap na. Awan ti mawahap ka anak!
Sa bawat pagsibol ng panibagong umaga, kaakibat nito ang panibagong simula. Panibagong pagkakataon upang higit na umunlad at sumagana. At tulad ng matayong nasinag ng araw, ang ating paaralan wala rin patid sa pagbibigay ng tanglaw ng liwanag at pag-asa patungo sa katuparan ng mga hangarin at pangarap ng bawat mag-aaral. Mula sa payak na simula, sa simpleng adhikaing makapagbigay ng dunong at inspirasyon sa bawat bata, ang ating paaralan ay patuloy na nagsusumikap upang higit na matulungan ang mga mag-aaral sa kanilang paglalakbay patungo sa rurok ng tagumpay. Kasabay nito ang pagbuo ng mga makukulay at masasayang mga karanasan at mga alaala kasama ang mga guro, mag-aaral at mga magulang. Ang pamamayagpag nito sa mga patimpalak, pagbabahagi ng natatanging mga kakayahan sa loob at labas ng paaralan. Bunga ng matibay na pundasyon at magandang samahan ng bawat isa, ang ating paaralan ay tunay na malayo na ang narating mula sa kanyang pakikibaka sa paglipas ng maraming mga taon. At tanda ng walang tigil na pakikibaka tungo sa kaunlaran at tagumpay, ang araw na ito ay magiging saksi sa isa na namang paglalayag at pagkilala sa ating inang paaralan para sa magsisipagtapos ng pag-aaral para sa kasalukuyang taon. Mga kaibigan, aming ibinabahagi sa inyo ang 2021 William Miranda Integrity School Virtual Graduation and Moving Up Ceremony. Ladies and gentlemen, the teaching staff of William Miranda Integrated School. Elementary Department. High School Department Kababayan ang Pambansang Awit ng Pilipinas. At this moment, may we all bow our heads as we pay tribute, honor, and glory to our Almighty God through this prayer. Panginoon, 
aming makapangyarihan at mapagmahal na Ama. Ang aming mga puso ay puspos ng galak sa araw na ito na ipinagkaloob mo sa amin. Lahat po ng mga bagay na inyong ibinibigay sa amin ay patunay ng inyong walang hanggang pagmamahal. Salamat po sa isa na namang taong magtatapos. Ganun din sa lahat ng mga mabubuting nangyari sa aming paaralan ngayong may pandemya. Salamat po sa mga magulang sa kanilang pagmamahal at pagsasakripisyo para sa bawat batang mag-aaral. Salamat po sa pagkabay sa mga guro sa patuloy na pagbabahagi ng kaalaman. Sa pagmamahal mo sa mga estudyanteng patuloy na nagsusumikap upang makapagtapos ng pag-aaral kahit na maraming malaki ang kanilang naranasan sa kanilang paglalakbay. Naniniwala po kami, Ama, na sa aming paglalakbay sa buhay, may mga pagsubok kaming kailangang lampasan. Pagamat minsan ay gusto namin magtago, alam namin hindi ito maaaring takasan. Sapagkat sa iyong karunungan, ang pandemyang ito, masakit at mga paghihirap na ito ang siyang magiging daan upang kami ay mas maging matatag at mabuting nilalang. Salamat po sa pagantabay sa amin. Taos puso po kaming humihingi ng tawad sa lahat ng aming kasalanan. Ang mga ito po ay bunga ng aming karupukan. Tulungan niyo po kaming hanapin ang kapayapaan at yakapin ang kabutihan. Sa araw po ito ng pagtatapos, lubos po kaming nagpapasalamat sa inyo. Buksan niyo po ang aming mga mata upang makita ang kagandahan sa aming paligid. Buksan niyo po ang aming mga tainga sa pagkikinig sa lahat ng mga mensaheng ibibigay sa pagtitipo ito. Naniniwala po kami na ito ay galing sa inyo. Buksan niyo rin po ang aming mga isipan upang piliin namin matutunan ang mga bagay na naaayon sa iyong kagustuhan. Higit sa lahat, Buksan niyo po ang aming mga puso para mas lalo namin mahalin ang mga bagay na ipinagaloob niyo sa amin. Sa amin po mga gagawing desisyon sa hinaharap, patuloy niyo po kami ang kabayan. Naway, gawin mo kami mga instrumento upang ang iyong pag-ibig ay patuloy na manatili sa lahat ng panahon ng aming buhay. Lahat pong ito ay amin ipinapanalangin sa ngalan ng iyong anak na Yesus. Amen. Opening Remarks of our Punong Barangay Honorable Cesar D. Oliva Muna sa lahat, nagpasalamat tayo sa ating Panginoong Diyos at binigyan tayo ng mabuting pagkakataon sa araw na ito. At binabati ko rin ang ating responsable, guwapo at magaling na ating teachers and girls, Sir Gilbert Manuel, at ang kanyang mga maganda at mga guwapong nagtuturo sa paralang ito ng Villa Miranda Integrated School, mga graduates, magulang, at nanonood sa araw na ito. Magandang araw po sa ating lahat. Sa mga magulang ng mga isudyanteng nagsisi pagtapos sa araw na ito, pagpusana tayo mag-isawang suportahan at gabayan ng ating mga anak sa kanilang mga pag-aaral. Tulungan natin silang maabot ang kanilang mga mithiin sa buhay sa pamamagitan ng laging pagpapaalaala sa kanila dahil ang tangumpay ng ating mga anak ay tangumpay din natin. Sa mga anak, Lagi kayong makikinig sa payo ng inyong mga magulang. Sapagkat walang magulang na gustong mapariwara ang kanilang mga anak. Kaya ang payo ko sa inyo, mga anak, mag-aral kayong mabuti. Pagsikapan at pagtyagaan ninyo ang lahat ng bagay, lalong-lalo na ang inyong pag-aaral. Dahil malay nyo, balang araw, ilang sa inyo ay magiging guro. At lagi nating tandaan, anuman ang marating ninyo sa buhay, tandaan ninyo, ang inyong mga paa ay nakaapak pa rin sa lupa. Muli, maligayang pagtatapos 
at magandang araw sa ating lahat. Welcome address from our PDA President, Ms. Evelyn D. Pacleba. Sa ating mga barang officials na pinamumunuan ng ating kagalang-galang na punong barangay, Honorable Assessor de Oliva, Sir, sa ating mga masisipag, matitsyaga, at magagaling na tagapagturo ng ating mga anak na pinamumunuan ng ating teacher in charge na si Sir Gilbert Manuel, Sir, mga bata, mga magsisipagtapos, mga magulang, magandang umaga sa ating lahat. Natapos na naman ang sampung buwan na pag-aaral ng ating mga anak sa pamamagitan ng modular classes na kahit hirap ang mga bata sa sitwasyong ito dahil sa ating naranasang pandemya sa ngayon. Sinikap pa rin nilang pag-aralan ang mga module na ibinibigay sa kanila ng ating mga guro. Sana panalangin nating lahat na malampasan na natin ang krisis na ito upang manumbalik na tayo sa dating normal na pamumuhay. Makabalik na sa eskwelahan ang mga bata at kahit hindi tayo magsuot ng face mask at face shield at wala na tayong pinangangambahan na sakit na makahawa sa kapwa. Sana alakasin ang ating paniniwala sa poong may kapal upang ang lahat ng ito ay ating malampasan sa ngayon matapos na rin. At sa mga magsisipagtapos, happy graduation and congratulations! To present to us our candidate for graduation, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Gilbert C. Manuel. Ma'am, I have the honor to present to you the candidates for graduation of Bilia Miranda Integrated School who successfully completed the basic requirements of the K-12 curriculum set by the Department of Education for the school year 2020-2021. By virtue of the power vested in me, as the OIC School's Division Superintendent of the Division of Isabella, and after having been certified by your principal that you have satisfactorily completed the requirements prescribed by the Department of Education under the K-12 Basic Education Program, I now accept and confirm you graduates of school year 2020-2021. Congratulations to all of you. A message from Public Schools District Supervisor, Dr. Edward A. Viscara. Back when we first stepped in the portals of this school, we were then innocent, curious, and eager to receive quality education. After seven long years for the elementary and six long years in secondary, look what we have become. We have survived the hardest testing and nurturing for excellent graduates. Every recollection, the good and not so pleasant challenging and exciting memories shall forever linger in our minds. Better yet sweet memories overwhelm us to reminisce how we, the young ones, have been shaped and molded by the committed teachers. To our most esteemed and equally respected teachers, thank you for the genuine desire to make us stand full at all times. Our success is your success, for you have given us the chance and the courage to excel, for we can achieve the best. To our ever-loving parents, enduring guardians, benefactors and supporters, we love and thank you for the sacrifices even to the point of forgetting your needs so you could provide everything for us. May the Lord reward all of us through success and all find ourselves ever increasing in gratitude above all to our Creator. To be grateful to our dear parents for their sacrifices, to our beloved teachers for the knowledge shared for even during the time of pandemic, 
to all DepEd officials, marami salamat po for your guidance and support. Very soon, each of us shall go forth seeking to make a mark upon the world. Farewell for now, but not goodbye. Mabuhay tayong lahat. guest, to our uh, beloved uh, LGU officials, to our dedicated principal together with the committed faculty and staff, to our uh, committed district supervisor, visitors, friends, ladies and gentlemen, and to all the graduates, awardees, completers, achievers, parents, good day. Amid pandemic, we ensured na walang may iwan. And we did. This school year, we collectively ventured into what many doubted as a worthy undertaking of the Department of Education. For most of you, the continuation of classes was a Herculean task to begin with. As for the very first time in recent history, we needed to shift from the customary face-to-face -face mode of learning to distance learning modality. Words can never describe how elated I am as I extend my uh, sincerest congratulations to you, dear graduates, completers, awardees, parents, guardians, and all our external stakeholders. This school year has been such a, an inconceivable test. And I am entirely appreciative of each and everyone who have made this arduous journey possible. Undeniably, you have waded through insurmountable odds. The seemingly impossible opening of classes, the difficult implementation of distance learning modalities, the inaccessibility of some learners and communities and the invaluable hardship of all our educators, parents, and other stakeholders as we face our unseen enemy. This global health crisis certainly prompted you to make big adjustments with how you deal with your personal lives and studies Yet, at the end of the day, you knew that you would always have a strong support system in DepEd to keep you grounded throughout your quest for quality, basic education. And look where that belief has taken you today. We in the school's division office of Isabella, along with your teachers, invested much of our time and resources to institute strategic plans in addressing different learning gaps and in delivering the best possible alternatives to strengthen the quality of our basic education. No matter how colossal the challenge this school year has brought to us all, we never chose to give up, and together, we conquered the battle. And there you are, our testaments to this immense success of the Department of Education. Indeed, I salute you, dear learners, completers, achievers, awardees, with your proud parents, for your persistence and love of learning. 
even with the absence of face-to-face -face classes, you were still able to prove how flexible you are in your quest for knowledge and wisdom. The school's division of Isabella has always championed quality and equitable education for the youth, and this school year, we never lost heart that we shall all remain triumphant in the end. Thus, may this uh, victory remind you of how well you struggled for your future as you opted to embrace the new normal in education. I can therefore say that our theme for the end of school year rights is strengthening the quality of education amid the COVID-19 pandemic is truly fitting as you continue to soar high in equipping yourselves with the necessary life skills and knowledge. This global health crisis has certainly taught us to intensify our campaign for accessible, inclusive, and quality education without sacrificing the health and safety of each and everyone. You may not have been physically present in the four corners of the classroom, but your determination to learn gave us hope that in SDO Isabella, walang batang may iwan. This hope, in turn, gave birth to strength. Strength to remain one with you in this tremendous academic journey. As you venture ahead, I want you to always look back to where you come from, your school, your teachers who took your hand and clothed you with the knowledge and skills you need, as well as your parents who have been with you since day one of your journey. So positivity from within yourselves and to others and never share the faith that this pandemic shall soon pass. As you march forward, never lose focus and be more tenacious in fulfilling your educational goals. I urge you to stop at nothing and just keep going. Do not let this health crisis stop you from quenching your thirst for wisdom. Your journey towards excellence has just begun and you still have a long and tedious voyage ahead of you. Ultimately, may you take the right attitude and realize that SDO Isabella is with you and continues to believe in your capabilities. We may have been bombarded with innumerable challenges as we wrestle with the COVID-19 pandemic, but what matters is that we did not give up too soon. We rather fought valiantly through it all. We take pride in these enormous achievements of yours, dear graduates, completers, achievers, awareness. Keep believing that there are more successes to come. As a poem aptly puts it, we are the masters of our fate and the captains of our song. Pandemic or otherwise, you are your own master and captain. Journey well in your pursuit of academic excellence. And we will always be with you throughout your journey because we remain and will always remain true to our commitment that in SDO Isabella, Walang batang maiiwan. Congratulations to all of you. My cordial greetings to all. During these tough times, as we operate within imperfect circumstances, we see 
the unfolding of one of the most beautiful things ever made on earth, the success of our young people in their academic journey as the ends day by day towards their dreams. To our dear learners, without a doubt, during these trying times, the struggles have been real and the challenges almost insurmountable. Today, we witness sense of purpose, direction and meaning, winning over every sign of difficulty that came your way as you toiled ceaselessly in the vineyard of education. Our theme this year is strengthening the quality of education amid the COVID-19 pandemic in a huge way recognizes our strength as people who cannot be floored by even the strongest of challenges. In fact, we have proven that together, working for a common vision, we are an armada of strong-willed individuals who cannot be swayed and discouraged by tribulations. Thanks for the deep sense of motivation that makes half the job accomplished. We have also shown that innovative minds always rule the day and that makes us prepared to confront each challenge that will beset us. The years do not promise an easy journey and with the threat of the pandemic still lurking around, the going will get tough and the tough must keep going and the spirit cannot be broken and will surely prevail. It is an irrefragable fact that despite our clean to varied ways of life, we have shown how united we can be in advancing the common agenda in education. We have done our share in realizing our ultimate goal of producing holistically developed K-12 basic education curriculum graduates who are not only knowledgeable and competent but also value-laden and discerning. We are diverse in culture and so we may have varied performances in all that we do, but we share a common goal to be the best version of ourselves so we can be of help to others in the best way we can. Our sense of shared destiny has allowed us to bend without breaking to attune our actions and efforts to the agenda of national leadership but it too proved that we can do so without diminishing our long-held principles that indeed it takes a village to raise a child. Each one of us, no matter how diverse, is a strand in the colorful fabric of human civilization. This is the value that we want you our dear graduates, to embrace and be proud of. Our sense of identity, either on a regional or national landscape, must remain an important consideration in achieving our goals and compromising it to favor new thoughts and ways of thinking must never be an option. We must continue to prove the world that even in the face of a dreaded pandemic, quality education can have its way through. The Department of Education Region 2 has unambiguously laid down in its Regional Education Development Plan all its projects, programs, and activities that shall inspire service above self and only about the future of learners who shall eventually assume significant roles in nation building. May you continue to be a proof that the kind of education our country is one for the world to share. Congratulations, dear parents, dear teachers, 
and to all of you learners, mabuhay kayong lahat! Good day to each and everyone who is uh, attending virtually present at this time of our graduation ceremonies for our beloved and uh, very precious uh, graduates uh, for the school year which ends at this uh, time. First of all, I'd like to greet the parents and family members without whose sacrifices, whose uh, reminders, and whose participation in the learning process for our uh, graduates have resulted in this culmination uh, program. Uh, this year, your role has changed uh, drastically. Where we've always thought, we've always believed that the matter of educating our children rests nearly exclusively on our teachers and our staff. This time, you parents, you family members, you who are in the households of our learners have expanded your role and contributed to this wonderful day wherein finally, finally, our learners are graduating in this culmination exercise. So congratulations because this year has not been very easy, has not been a, a picnic for our teachers, for our family members, as well, uh, especially the parents, mothers, fathers, sisters, brothers, and all who have contributed to the uh, achievement of our learners at this time. We'd also like to thank the local government units for their interest, for their cooperation, and for their continuing, continuing uh, contributions to the needs of education, even as our children do not go to school. But of course, most of the congratulatory uh, greetings of fall on the deserving uh, graduate. Each and every one of you is truly special. You are different from the other graduates who have passed through the portals of your school. You went to school practically without seeing your teachers, if at all. You went to school with your parents, your mothers, and your fathers hovering over your shoulders and seeing to it that you are able to complete your assignments. You are completing your studies at a time when examinations and assessments are different. You are culminating this uh, long months of, of hard work at this time, uh, even as you have to do family chores, even as you are distracted, and even as your world has turned upside down and it seems and it appears as if we don't know what the future holds and what will happen next. But you have persevered and now you are ready to graduate. And therefore you deserve each and every bit of congratulations from us in the Department of Education. I have said that you are very special. You are very different. You are pioneering. There has been no other class like your class. There has been no other graduate like you as a graduating student because you are the very first graduate of the blended 
learning response to education uh, in the Philippines. So today, this is why we call it, we call this exercise a commencement exercise. It's not the end of our studies. It's not the end of all our efforts with blended learning, with modules, with floods, with earthquakes, and of course, with COVID. It's a commencement of doors opening to you. More doors will be open because you are a graduate. Congratulations once more to each and every one of you. Congratulations to you parents and family members. Congratulations to you teachers. When I was chair of the board of Silliman University, each time we had graduation ceremonies during the baccalaureate and during commencement itself, I would cry. I would cry because you are sending out into the world a new batch of, of graduates and we want to be sure that what is awaiting them is appropriate. We want to be sure that they are ready for what awaits them when they select which door to open. And so, we tell you, go out to the world, do whatever you want to do. God be with you and be sure be assured that all of us love each and every one of you congratulations and now ladies and gentlemen the graduates and completers of villa miranda integrated school batch 2021 Kinder Completers Bausa U1A Kaban Ryan JP Colliado John Mark C Islao DJP Malwar Randall A. Martinez Mark Eugene E. Ortega Jason A. Pakleba Jmar G. Prado RJT. Prado Melvin A. Soria RJM Flores Daniela M Martin Mal C Pagirigan Ana S Romero Rosan A Talosig Queen Mabel G The graduates of Batch 2021 Aserit Jericho M Aguinaldo Mark Anthony C Aguinaldo Prince Iser B Claudit Doniver V Daniel Romel D Domingo J. March A. Francisco Antonio V. Francisco Benji B. Jose Marvin C. Jose PJP. 
lagi smart Ismail R Magawai Dustin Sadi M Magas Kelvin I Montane CJA Montanes John Mark A Pakleba Joey Mark G Pitpit John John W Reyes John Christian T Velasco JPM Velasco JVC Wanya Robinson V Alejo Jonabel I Andana Princess Joy A Balido Rosemary G Kalawad Jennifer M Collado Rosen Jane T Echore Ruby Jane T Galut Jinky C Jose Vilma C Montanes Rica May D Pakleba Richel G Romero Jenny A Velasco Jane G Velasco Lisel C The Bats 2021 Grade 10 Completers Arcega Jerry P Claudit Renante Jr. A Kalitdan LJF Purpose Roden G Gutierrez Edmar B Ignacio Jackson F Islao Dungeon P Jose Jerwin P Manalastas Rodolfo S Romero Richard D Velasco Charlie Jr. S Velasco Daniel S Velasco John Mark T Agari Mary Jane A Bitamu Marquis A Mulan Marinel M Cabaldo GGL Caban Shaira Shell P Carbonet Remalin Ad Kuritana Daisy B Maramag Mary Jane V Martinez Jovelin P Mohar Rizame D Morada Jessel A Ugalde Aries S Usbal Julian S
the Academic Excellence Award is for Grade 10. With honors, Mary Jane A. Angari. With honors, Marquis A. Vitamu. With honors, Marinel M. Bulan. First place, San Mariano 2 District, Sign Math Olympic, Science Quiz B. Second place, Legislative District 2 Level, Sign Math Olympic, Science Quiz B. With honors, Charlesel E. Caban. With honors, Remaline I. Carbonell. With honors, Florencio P. Cayari. With honors, Jerwin P. Jose. With honors, John Mark T. Velasco. First place, San Mariano 2 District, Sai Mat Olympic, CN Sicula. Second place, Legislative District 2 Level, Sai Mat Olympic, CN Sicula. Words of Gratitude from Marinel M. Bula To the hardworking teachers of this school, headed by the ever-supportive teacher-in-charge Sir Gilbert Manuel, the barangay officials headed by the barangay captain Honorable Cesar D. Oliva, parents, friends, fellow completers, and viewers, a pleasant day to all. Indeed, I'm so honored to have this opportunity to publicize my deepest appreciation to this success. First of all, I want to thank God for these wonderful blessings. Along my journey, I can say that it was not a smooth sailing. Waves of personal and academic problems came and tested me. There were times that I thought of quitting, but God did not leave me. Every time when problem comes my way, I used to read and hold into His Word in Philippians 4.13 that I can do everything through Him He gives me strength. What I am and where I am now is because of Him. I owe these things to Him. Thank you, Lord God. Secondly, the success of mine is because of my family. Words are powerless to express my gratitude. I am thankful because you have continuously strengthened and inspired me without which I would have never come to reach this moment. You have all given much to see this day, and I hope that in some way I have made you proud. Thank you for your love and support. We may not be rich in some aspects, but your love for us makes us wealthy. I appreciate your efforts and sacrifices for the family. You expose yourself under the heat of the sun just to provide our needs. The word sacrifice is a good thing when it is done for the good of the family. This is the lesson your lives have taught me. It will be forever engraved in my mind and in my heart. Inang, tatang, thank you po. I promise to achieve all the dreams of your life that you couldn't because you were busy making sure that I achieved mine. To our teachers, on behalf of my classmates, you have done more than words can express. We understand we were far from perfect students. Today, we show you our sincerest gratitude for molding our characters and for showing us that there is still much to learn. Your firm guidance will always be appreciated for we now realize that nothing grows well under the shade of a large tree. We may not remember what you said, but we will never forget your voice. Thank you for being the irreplaceable teachers that you are. We may not say it out to you aloud, but you made a beautiful impact in our lives. We may sometimes behave annoyingly, but deep down in our hearts, we know that you care for us lovingly. Your compliments and encouragement have always been important to us, but your punishment and criticism have been more important because they made us what we are today. Thank you for all the efforts you made to help us grow and encourage us to face the challenges in life. We are so grateful for having teachers like you, kind, caring, beautiful, and handsome teachers. We will be always proud to be graduates of William Miranda Integrated School. We may leave this institution, but the learning, love, and values that we obtained will remain forever in our hearts. To my classmates and friends, 
finally, we reached this point. Thank you for everything. Thank you for helping me to open my door and windows. Thank you for reaching me out of the confinement. Since elementary, I was timid. However, as time passed, I learned to adjust and mingle with people. With you, my friends, you have colored my journey with laughter, pains, joys, and conflicts. You make happiness worth sharing. Thanks for being with me through thick and thin. Your support and understanding give me strength to continue fighting. The pieces of advice you gave me are highly appreciated. Thank you for believing in me when I'm starting to doubt my capabilities. You might not know this, but you helped me find happiness in being a person that I really am. I owe you tons for the pull of awesome memories together. My friends, we have been through the easiest and difficulties in life. Time has come and gone swiftly, and when one glances back at the past, it is a blessing that we have shared a few of the most memorable years of life together. This tie shall remain strong wherever life may lead us. As we grow old and take a look back in life, we will see that some of the best memories will be the simple moments we spent together. I owe you a big thanks for being my friends. Our friendship helps us bloom into the person we are. To my fellow completers, graduation may simply be equated as the end of the tunnel or a breath of relief but after years under the nurture of our alma mater. We know it is much more than any of this. Life is an open road and though we've studied its highways and byways, we were never left without a road map. Our teachers, parents, and friends have been constantly our guide. As we part, we do not know where life takes us. Wherever our destiny may lead us, we must be strong enough to face it. I know this graduation is only one of our thousands of dreams in life. According to Sir Rolando, set our goals higher and achieve them. But in achieving them, we must have faith and see to it that our feet remain on the ground. Again, thank you all and good morning. The Pledge of Loyalty We, the graduates of the school year 2020-2021, do solemnly pledge to live up to the high of service for which our school stands and to uphold the best tradition for our people and country and to discharge fully and willingly our solemn duties and responsibilities as a citizen of Republic of the Philippines to the end that we shall bring honor and happiness to our school, parents, country, and God. The children of yesterday's dream. We are the promise of the future we bring. Waving the banner of love to all, to every nation, the rich and the poor. We are the world of the restless and young. And we need the hand. Guide us Helping each other Build each other As long as we're together You and me For together we stand Divided we fall Together we climb To the top of the world We can be what we want for the world to see that we are the children of yesterday's dream. We have the yearning to do what is best. Someone special from all the rest Nation and brothers in unity Building together
tomorrow for you and for me. We are the world of the restless and young, and we need a hand to guide us. Helping each other, build each other. As long as we're together, you and me. For together we stand, divided we fall. Together we climb to the top of the world. We can be what we want for the world to see. That we are the children of yesterday's dream. Together we stand, divided we fall. Together we climb to the top of the world. We can be what we want for the world to see. That we are the children. Children of yesterday's dream. As we end, may we hear a message from Sir Gilbert C. Manuel. Ang aking pagbati sa mga magsisipagtapos sa taong ito, sa mga magulang, ang aking mga kapwa-guro, at maging ang ating mga kasangga sa pagtatangguyod ng mas maayos na Villa Miranda, ang mga opisyal ng barangay at opisyal ng pamunuan ng mga magulang, isang mapagpalang araw po sa ating lahat. Ang taong ito ay may tuturing na taon na puno ng pagsubok dahil sa pandemya ang ating kinakaharap, maging sa edukasyon ng ating mga anak kung saan lahat ay naging kabahagi at malaki ang naging papel ng bawat magulang upang maipagpatuloy ang kanilang pag-aaral. Ngunit sa kabilang banda, masasabi at may tuturing pa rin natin na ang taong ito ay taon ng tagumpay at pag-asa. Isang patunay ay ang araw na ito, ang araw ng pagtatapos. Ako'y tauspusong bumabati sa mga magsisipagtapos, tunay na gagalak ang inyong abang lingkod dahil sa gitna ng problema na dulot ng pandemya, hindi kayo sumuko. Bagkos na natiling matatag at buo ang inyong loob. Nasa kabila ng hamon na makabagong pamamaraan ng pag-aaral, nandun ang isang hangarin at determinasyon magpatuloy at abutin ang minimithing pangarap. Sa mga magsisipagtapos na nasa eksampong baitang, The Completers, malayo pa ang inyong lalakbayin patungo sa katuparan ng inyong mga pangarap. Ngunit naniniwala ako na makakaya at magagawa ninyo anuman ang darating na pagsubok. Gamitin, palaguin, pagyamanin at gawing sandata ang bawat kaalaman na inyong natutunan sa inyong minamahal na paaralan. Gawing gabay ang mga kabutihang asal at dunong na kinintal sa inyong mga puso't isipan ng inyong mga mapagmahal na guro. Tandang-tanda ko pa sa isang yugto ng aking buhay noong ako'y nagtapos sa elementarya. Sa isang pagtatanghal na aming idinaos na tinatawag na acoustic na binubuo naming mga magsisipagtapos. Hawak ang letrang A sa salitang pagtatapos ng sabi. Ang iyong pangarap pilit abutin, pagsikapan at kamtin. Kaming mga magulang mo, huwag bibiguin dahil ikaw lamang ang pag-asa namin. Pilitin kung hindi man ang pinakamaningning na bituin, kundi ang bituing magdadala sa katuparan ng inyong mga pangarap. Hawak ang isang paniniwalang, tanging ang edukasyon lamang ang susi sa pagkakaroon ng magandang bukas. Hangat ko ang tagumpay ng bawat isa. Sa mga magulang na nagtsagang sumubaybay sa pag-aaral ng kanilang mga anak, naniniwala ako na hindi naging madali ang inyong naging tungkulin. 
binabati ko kayo at nagpapasalamat ako ng lubos dahil po sa inyong tulong at suporta na pagtagumpayan nating may taguyod ang taong ito ng kanilang pag-aaral. Oras at panahon po inyong ginugol. May tuturing na biyaya ang mga kapakukuros ng paaralang ito. Dahil sa kanilang hindi matatawarang dedikasyon at commitment, masasabi nating malayo na nga ang narating ng ating paralan at maging ang ating mga mag-aaral. Isang patunay dito at sa unang pagkakataon, ang Batang Bilya Miranda na namayagpag sa isang patimpalak ng agham at matematika, hindi lamang sa ikalawang distrito ng San Mariano and also not only in the Legislative District too, kundi sa buong sangay ng Isabela. Bitbit ng ating isang mag-aaral ang bandila at pangalan ng ating paaralang Bilya Miranda. Kasabay ng tagumpay ng ating mga mag-aaral, ang walang sawang suporta ng ating mga barangay officials, PTA officers at mga magulang na sa loob lamang ng higit tatlong taon ng ating pagsasama bilang isang pamilya. Masasabi nating maging ang paaralan ating pinapangarap ay unti-unting natutupad dahil sa simula pa lang, sabay-sabay tayong nangarap, patuloy na nangangarap nagsusumikap at nagkakaisang tuparin ang bawat pangarap para sa ating mga anak. Ang hamon sa bawat isa, patuloy nating tugunan ang mga pangailangan sa paghatid ng dekalidad na edukasyon, tanging ang pagkakaisa at pagtutulungan ang magsisilbing tulay sa pagpanday ng bagong umaga para sa batang bilya. Muli ang aking pasasalamat at pagbati sa ating lahat. Hawak ang pangarap ng Batang Bilya, magagawa at malayo pa ang ating mararating. As we continue to believe that in Villa Miranda Integrated School, we perform, we transform. Again, my warmest congratulations to one and all. Happy graduation and God bless everyone. Arangkada pa, Villa Miranda. The Villa Miranda Integrated School Teaching Staff would like to express their deepest gratitude to the GPTA officials, Honolulu PTA officers, parents, and stakeholders for extending their valuable support and cooperation that contributed to the successful implementation of all programs and endeavor of the VMIS for the graduates and completers of the school year 2020-2021. Thank you and God bless us all.